So what is programming? Well, it helps to start with a toy that we all used when we were younger. And as I draw it, you might start to understand what I'm drawing, even though my drawing is not that great. I, of course, am drawing Lego blocks. Now, Lego blocks, you could put them together, you could stack them up, and you could make lots of things with them. So I could take all of those blocks and I could make some kind of house, if I so wished. So in essence, Lego is taking ver various components, sticking them together, and then making something from it. And you'll be pleased to know that's exactly what programming is. Programming is taking little blocks of code and then arranging them somehow or however we please into a piece of software. Now the software can be on your computer, your Mac, a mobile phone, it doesn't matter, on the web, on a server, any of those. What's important here is that we're taking these pieces of code, we are arranging them in our software in the order that we need them to be in, so that when I come along and I give this software some input, some keystrokes, some numbers, letters, whatever, it doesn't matter, the software will use all of those bits of code in the particular order to create some output for me. So in a nutshell, that is what is programming. We are taking various blocks of code, arranging them in various orders, so that we get an input, we can do something with it in the software, and then from that we can get an output. So in practice, what does this look like? Well, let's say I have the most basic of programs which is a calculator. And I've got various buttons here that I can press, virtual buttons, I can press them with my mouse or my number pad, it doesn't matter. What I'm doing here when I press a button is I'm giving my software an input. I'm saying here is a number. And then when I press some kind of multiply and then another number, the software is doing some kind of calculation and that calculation is going to lead to an output. And in our case, the output would be something on the main display of our calculator software. So that's just a very basic example of exactly what programming is and how it works in software.